how to make a flowchart of any program in any programming language in a very easiest way. Yes, I will explain you that, how you can do that. Okay, so today in this video, I will explain you how to make a flowchart of even odd program in any programming language. So in my previous video, I have explained the basic things of this software which I am using, Flowgorithm, and few videos are available. You can check the playlist. Okay. So to check whether the given number is even or odd, we need one variable or we need one number. So if we need number, we need variable. So first of all, we'll use this declare to declare a variable so let's say i will use here and type it is asking it is integer type because i am going to store number after declaration we need to take input so user will give any number so i will say in n variable store the number it is input next after taking input we need to check whether it is even or odd for even the number which is divisible by two it is even so we need to check condition so i will use this control if box so this condition is if this condition is true whatever the condition i will write the number is even else that is false it will go here and print number is odd so what is the condition the number is divisible by 2 that means number modulo 2 equals to equals to 0 comparing so given number we are dividing by 2 this percent symbol called modulo it will give the remainder so we are dividing the given number by 2 and it gives remainder so if number is remainder is 0 if remainder is 0 then it is even so I am checking the condition and mod 2 equals to equals to 0 if you are using QBasic programming you need to write only one equals to here if you are using any other programming language you should write double equals to for comparison so in this flow algorithm, we need to write double equals to. So this is the condition. Now if it is true, then we need to display value output. So I will select here output. In the output, we use double quotation to display the value. So number is even. If this condition is false, that means number is not divisible by two, then that is what odd. So output again, double click. Take double quote and number is odd. Good. Done. This is the flowchart for even or odd. So let's execute this. Click on this step. Yeah, integer variable n is declared. Next step input n. So we need to enter the value. Now it is asking enter value for n. So I will give here 8. Enter. Okay, I'll minimize this and click step again. So it check the condition condition is true so it is going here output number is even so it will display the result output is yeah number is even so we entered the number eight it is even so let me make it a little bit small in size and let me, let me show you step by step okay you can click here in the run button you can click here in the step also so step integer n is declared next input so we need to enter the value so it is asking enter any number i will enter here 7 for now enter it is checking condition 7 is divisible by 2 or not 7 modulo 2 equals to equals to 0 it means dividing 7 by 2 whether we get 0 or not i think no yes so condition is false and in the output it will display a number is odd so next yeah number is odd done so in this way it works if you are not able to get this screen what you can do is just you can go to the tool and console window so the console window will be open okay it is done now if you want to display the value in the output screen so you can write here and person symbol and 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 so it will display the value so let me run this again quickly so i'll enter here 15 that is odd number enter and then go to the next step you can go from here also so you can see number is odd 15 correct because of this so this is the flowchart and you can make flowchart very easily using this software
Thank you for watching. If it is helpful for you, don't forget to subscribe this channel, write the comment, and like this video.